Hello! Um, so we're back with another video. Um, sorry. <laughs> so we're back with another video. Um, today's video is called Reasons I Got Beat As A Kid. Number one, when I was about 15, 16, no, I was like 18. So I went out and uh, my friends, we had like a barbecue in church and it was getting to like seven o'clock and Oh, I caught it. Oh, sorry, that was nasty. Sorry. <laughs> and my mum was like ringing me, ringing me, ringing me, ringing me, ringing me, ringing me. I just started to ignore her calls. And all the African kids out there can kind of relate that when it's getting late and your parents are getting pissed off, walking home feels like a death sentence. So I'm walking home, and so like my house is in like a cul-de-sac, so it's like this. So I'm walking into the cul-de-sac, and I look at my house, and the door is wide open, and my mum is literally leaning against the door frame like this one hand up here and the other hand down here holding a belt i get in and the, the, there's not even a second for me to breathe and she literally just starts shouting and the belt just comes out of nowhere i'm trying to run up the stairs to my room i'm clawing up the stairs my woman is beating me beating me beating me beating my dad is nowhere to be found and i can hear crime watch in the living room so i'm thinking why do parents sit at home when the children are out and watch crime watch why would you do that so when i was about when i was about 12 um my friend gate had like my friend had some like pink nail varnish and i'd never had my nails painted before so i was just like can i have some so she painted my nails and i got home and immediately it was a friday night so friday nights we nights 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 <laughs> friday nights we used to go to church not the club church casually dying in the video yep gulp that phlegm down and i went to church and then so we're sitting in church and i'm trying to chip this nail varnish off i don't know what i was thinking why would i put on nail varnish when i knew i couldn't keep on i don't know i don't know so i was trying to chip it off so then one of the pastors saw me and then one of the pastors looked at my dad and then my dad looked at the pastor and then he looked at me and that was it i don't know if anyone can relate to that drive home when you're in the car and your parents are trying to beat you but they can't look back so they're holding one hand on the steering wheel and the other hand is just using it to chase your feet and I, I, I remember I, I remember I remember my mum just saying are you a witch? are you a witch? Are you? and I was just like I don't I didn't see the correlation between long pink nails and witchcraft but apparently there is one so I was just screaming and crying and the whole night was just I think there was 40 lashes involved okay so when me and my brother were okay I'm three and a half years older than my brother so when I was like I think I was like 13 I hope I was 12 or younger so that can excuse the disgusting act that I did um so So, Daniel, care to explain yourself? Um... Because I distinctly remember it, this thing, your idea. What? Was this my idea? <laughs> I think it was your idea. Um... I don't know what seemed so... I think it was the the idea of liquid yeah. being hoovered into the hoover. It seemed that was, quite that was, at it, the time. it was funny and it was also <laughs> scientifically intriguing. And we kept hoovering it. Until it, well, I, had, I don't know I why think we did. Broke. Yeah, no, I think no, no, no! It, it started to smell. Oh yeah. <laughs> the house started to smell like pee, and then our parents started to wonder where the smell was coming from, and then somehow they broke our shower. You even broke. The you even broke. It, the even finished. It was gone. <laughs> that was disgusting. Yeah. Yeah. Not one of our. One of our best highlights. Then there was a time when I was in, I was in like year four. Do you remember when I was good? So I got the hamster. There was a hamster called Harry, and there was a hamster called Sally. And then I was good. Like if you're good, stop shaking your head. Stop judging me. <laughs> I was good, so I got the hamster for the weekend. So I got Harry, and so I brought him home. Do you remember me bringing him home? Yep. Do you remember? Like it was yesterday. <laughs> I was in a cage and then it got like a little ball that you could put him in. So like on the first, they're nocturnal. So I was being good with it. I was feeding him. I put him in that little rolly thing, but it was just too much. And like the excitement, which he was just going all over the place and I just couldn't handle it. So I put him back in the cage, but I was feeding him like a lot, like a lot. So I took him back to school on the Monday. And then on the Tuesday, Harry was gone. I didn't understand. I 
And then the thing is, Sally, Sally was cool. Sally was fine. And she had like blood around her mouth and her claws were like bloody. Turns out Sa Sally ain't Harry. <laughs> I just think I think I found him, and I just I just felt so responsible. I, it was it was so hard. It's okay. I miss him so much. I was like twelve, and you grasped on me. I don't know what you did, but you did something vile. So my mom had made like rice and bread stew for both of us, and I was in the kitchen. So me, yeah, I just you know put my face over the food, and I oh, was about to I was spitting. So the spit was the spit was like falling. Imagine slope from my mouth. And then my mum walked in and she's like, what are you doing? And I was just like, nothing. She was just like, you can eat that one then. And she and the, the thing is, I think if I told her what you'd done, she would have been on my side. I think <laughs> I was like in year three. So basically my friend was light skinned and she had this boy boyfriend called Michael. We're together. Okay. Yeah. And then I wrote a book on how to steal your friend's boyfriend. Oh, yeah. Um, do you remember this happening? I, it was, yeah, it was like a diary kind of yeah. thing. Yeah, and the mum and dad, dad found it. it. Yeah. At the time, I just didn't see what was wrong with it. <laughs> yeah. how, you, how old are you in year three? You were like seven. Oh my gosh, that's sick. <laughs> that's sick. This time, I was like 11. Daniel knows this story already. And like, I couldn't tell the time quick, quick enough in the house. And my mum and dad were like getting annoyed with me. And I just didn't know what to do. And the more they got annoyed with me, the more I couldn't tell the time. Like, it was just too much pressure. And so they were getting annoyed. And then they were just like, just pack your bags. Just go. So I started packing my bags, like a little, like this little Tesco bag, plastic bag. And I started putting my bags in. <laughs> and I even thought to myself, you know the three little pigs when they run away from home, they put the stick and then they tie the bag into the stick. I was thinking, where am I going to get myself a stick now? <laughs> Mom and Dad came to my room, they're like, ah, my little jock! The vitamins, do you want the rats in the house? To be fair, right? You know, no, 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 more no, 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 no. you've done more worse things than I have. You've done way, way worse things than I have. It's Thinking about that, it now, I've, that, I've had little. It's not little that I trouble. did bad things. I just, I just. You didn't know how to use your brain. I just. I was a special child. So, Bob and Dad used to give us these vitamins for kids, and I didn't like them. He used to eat them. Mm, no, I you'd, mean, you'd, yeah, you'd. Get, <laughs> so, um, I used to like throw them behind the. The chim the fireplace. The fire, yeah. I used to throw them behind the fireplace and so <laughs> I remember just watching TV one day and like a huge rat just crawled behind the TV and they're fast and they're huge and I was just like <sighs> And then my parents were like, Where are they coming from? Why are they so big? And I was just like How big are they? And they were like, Oh they're that big? Hmm? They were huge and fat. Wow. What did I do to my household? <laughs> So it turned out they were eating the vitamins, and I hope, yeah, I just... The mum and dad found out, like, there's hundreds of vitamins there. I just, I'm not a bad child. should have just got endless beatings, to be honest. <laughs> okay, um, you, yeah, you're saying that some of yours have been pretty bad, though. Yeah, I've had some bad experiences. But I, yours were just dumb, or from from greed. I love money too much. <laughs> this one, thieving. He was always stealing. This one. I've stopped. God has changed my ways. <laughs> God has kind to me. Yeah, amen, amen. Glory to God. Yeah, I think I stole. No, I didn't. Someone gave me their mom's money. Ah, good. Boring. Good. Boring. This was ages ago. This was when I was like thirteen or something like that. You and then, oh, yeah. Come on. And um, yeah, and then my parents and the the parent asked for their money back. God, so they came God, to our God, house. God, and God, then God, 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 God. <laughs> my mum had to give them. You've already spent it, haven't you? Know, I spent. The thing is. Oh, no. <laughs> the thing is, is because they gave me a twenty pound note, and then I had like bare coins. So like they didn't. I had like fifty p's and all of that added to it. Anyway, that's not the point. The point is. <laughs> Yeah, so, um, yeah, my mum gave them the money and then, her own pocket. yep, so I had to give my parents the money that I had and my dad just, um, yeah, so I went Descended. through, yeah, 
like 16 rounds through the oh, night. Oh, this is a this is a school night, by the way. But yeah, I went through like 16 rounds of beatings with my dad throughout the night. And like he was tired, I was tired. <laughs> Sometimes like we'll have like little breaks in between, <laughs> and he'll and he'll get me to like go on my knees and like I'll drift off to sleep on my knees and then he'll wake me up and then yeah and then he'll drift off to sleep and then I'll like give myself a break <laughs>